This piece was, uh, was we, we designed this years ago and um, it's funny because we've distinguished our Marvel lines with the Comic Cat series and then with the Diorama series. And this technically is around our Comic Cat scale, but there's two characters in it, so that way it now becomes a diorama. But it was kind of one of those things where if we were going to do Thanos, we kind of had to do death because it, pretty much his entire existence in the Marvel Universe has been about making her happy or trying to make her happy. Specifically in the Infinity Gauntlet storyline where Thanos got his hand on the Infinity Gauntlet there with the Infinity Gems and use those to basically warp reality and he built the giant cathedral almost for death and had giant stone faces of her human face and then the skull face which actually the skull face for this piece is the exclusive um, we got that idea because if you look at the giant throne thing he built in outer space one side of it is her face with the hood and then on the other side it's the hood and then inside it's a skull because sometimes it switches back and forth so we thought that'd be a great idea for the exclusive um, the storyline was awesome because there were so many characters in it. It was one of the, the big uh, landmark storylines of the year where everybody came together. Um, so, uh, Silver Surfer was in it, Thor was in it, Captain America, um, Adam Warlock. There, I mean, there was just a ton of people that was in it at one point or another. And during one of the battles, uh, Thanos pretty much laid waste to everybody. So we tried to give it that idea of both the, the temple with the rock base and the kind of step, and then also the key items that you know of from other characters, Silver Surfer's board, Thor's hammer, Captain America's shield, and then also you can see Thor's cape strung along at the front of the stairs. <laughs>